Hello, this is October the 6th, uh, 2011, Abraham Weisfeld speaking to you live, uh, direct from uh, Nablus, uh, Palestine. This is in the uh, Doar, the central square of Palestine, just above my uh, right shoulder. You will see the tent camp protest across the street here uh, from the cafe from which I am broadcasting. And this is a, uh, a protest camp in solidarity with the Palestinian political prisoners and the prisoners of war who are on a hunger strike. They are on a hunger strike because of their treatment inside the Zionist prisons. Inside the Zionist prisons, they were kept in um, administrative segregation or isolation, or the hole as it's called, in order to separate them one from the other so they could not uh, uh, organize themselves within the prison itself, uh, which is contrary to international regulations. And uh, <coughs> even though uh, the, uh, the Red Cross does not seem to be doing very much, you know, for their benefit in that respect. So they have gone on a hunger strike, which started on uh, Monday. Uh, on Monday, there was a march which ended up uh, here in downtown uh, Nablus, in Palestine, and the camp, tent camp was uh, inaugurated in that fashion. It has continued ever since, and the women who have launched this project are continuing this protest day and night, and are on a hunger strike now themselves. Uh, they are uh, sitting in a circle, each uh, uh, holding a picture of their uh, family relation who is being kept in prison. Um, there is uh, uh, going to be a march today from the youth movement to come down and take their solidarity with this protest camp. Today, representatives, 25 representatives of the Palestinian Labor Federation came to express their support of this protest camp. The Palestinian Labor Federation comprises uh, at least 5,000 Palestinian workers and uh, uh, indire indirectly represent the Palestinian workers within um, 348 uh, uh, Palestine, Palestine um, the state of Israel, uh, indirectly as well. Now, uh, what uh, we have is an increase in the political activity of the Palestinian resistance movement, which is a uh, uh, peaceful movement in, uh, in uh, making itself uh, heard through uh, political means now, both in the United Nations and here on the street, in the streets of the various cities of Palestine. Here in the street of Nablus, uh, we can uh, observe uh, what is happening here. The police are being cooperative, and uh, there is a general support from all factions from um, the uh, activists involved who were from the PFLP, from the P, uh, Palestine, uh, Palestine Front for the Liberation of Palestine, Popular Front for the Liberation of Palestine, the PFLP, the Democratic Front for the Liberation of Palestine, Fatah, Fatah the, uh, the ruling party in the government uh, of the Palestine Authority here in the West Bank, and in um, the uh, Foreign Office, International Relations of the United Nations, etc., and all the diplomatic offices throughout the world. 132 countries support uh, the recognition of Palestine, and uh, the United States is trying to prevent the General Assembly from considering uh, the uh, resolution to recognize uh, Palestine as well. Now, I'm going to uh, uh, an event which is a poetry reading of solidarity with anger strikers at the moment, uh, and uh, so I will uh, be ending uh, this uh, live broadcast uh, for the moment, but I will give you a a view of the, uh, of the street here with the camera. And then I will be coming back to report to you on the demonstration that will be happening this evening. This is Abraham Weisfeld, broadcasting live from Naples, Palestine. There, you have a better view of the protest camp across the street. There, in the center is a uh, is the uh, circle. Uh, um, circular uh, patch of grass, the only grass in the whole city. On the left-hand side is the um, memorial for the uh, PFLP martyrs, and uh, just down here in front is a um, memorial for the Fatah the martyrs uh, as well. I will show you that first.
here's the Fifth Avenue Memorial. And there, on the left with the uh, red banner above it, is the uh, PFLP uh, Martyrs Memorial. Up above on the roof, you will see flags of the PFLP uh, floating high. And just in front of it, on smaller ones, reaching out are the DFLP banners. There is the protest camp right across from the circular uh, park in the center. Across the street is a market area and the entrance to the old city, which of course is uh, the entrance to the old city. When I mean old, I mean old. This is the fourth oldest city in the world, 3,500 years old. In the entranceway to the old city there, you can see a banner for the martyrs of Hamas. large building is a new uh, shopping plaza established since 2003 when I was here last and what I showed you in the background uh, at the end of the streets uh, is the rising uh, city of uh, Nablus uh, which climbs up the uh, mountains which surround it. Okay, bye for now. I will be back with you soon.